let's go subscribe. Let's go next week. So Penelope is two years and <coughs> ten months old, and she is going to be starting Montessori school next week. With her starting school, we got a list of things that she needed. So everything is on the ground right here. It's quite a bit of things. So we're going to start with her backpack, and this is going to be Penelope's first time seeing almost all of these things. So she's going to be giving you guys her like live reaction to seeing her school supplies. So for Penelope's backpack, I got it at Target. What do you think about it? <laughs> you like it? It's cool. Get I picked up this backpack today at Target and I love it. Look at the straps. It's yellow. Has a little holder here so if she wants to hold it or if she wants to wear it on her back. Whoa! Nice, Penelope! She's not going to have homework or anything that she needs a backpack for, but I'm going to have her lunchbox in here, her water bottle. Every week we have to bring in a fresh sheet of blanket, a crib sheet, extra clothes. So all of that is going to be in her backpack. And then I got her lunchbox. So I'm going to show you guys three lunchboxes. I know three, like she doesn't need three but one I got last year and she's never used it before just because she was like way smaller and it was a little heavy on her and I found her one at Target the other day it was like a last minute thing and I didn't really like it and then I went to Target again today and I found one way better so I'm gonna show you all three of those these are her lunch boxes here's one here's another one with little monkeys this is the last minute one that I didn't really like and then this is the one that I got last year for her and this is from Amazon and it was pretty pricey it was $40 but it's honestly like the best thing ever like this is the lunch box itself and it's really hard so you open it like this and then as soon as you open it like the lunchbox is the lunchbox in itself so it comes with this divider that you can divide so if you want to put like strawberries or chips or something and then it has another compartment here and then this thing is for hot foods so if you want to put like soup or macaroni and cheese pasta and if you don't have hot foods and you just want to put like a sandwich this lifts up and you have a compartment right here even if like your kids bang it and throw it on the ground and like whatever they do to it like it's super sturdy so it's never gonna break this is her monkey lunchbox it just has this right here and this but i'm gonna return this i found it on clearance for seven dollars this is the one i found today it was six dollars something cents and i really like this one because it's like sturdy so even if she drops it and like decides to play like dodgeball with it with her friends then her food's not gonna get crushed because like it's really sturdy in here so i'm gonna be using this one and this one for school i'm gonna be switching between them which one is your favorite uh this one? Yeah. Nice. And now for a bunch of school supplies. So this is going to be Penelope's first time seeing all of this. First, I got her ultra clean washable markers, colored pencils. Now all of this was on her school supply list. A pack of 24 crayons, glue sticks, glue. And then they also asked for us to get erasers, so I got this pack of three erasers in the dollar section. And I actually found erasers in like the school supply section that they were pretty ugly, I'm not gonna lie. And they were like three dollars or something, and then I went and found these, and these are way cuter. Yay. You're welcome. Then they asked for us to buy her like a bin. I, I don't even know what the word of this is called. You know what it is. It's like a, a a bin to put your pencils and all that stuff. Thank the Lord they had some, and this was the only one left. You know what this is? I think to put pencils. Scissors and and that. And a requirement was that we have to label all of her things. We have to label her water bottles, Whoa. her lunchbox, her box. We have to label just anything possible. Yes. You don't want her things getting confused with other kids. So you know me, you gotta be number one mom. I bought a label maker and a set of refills. So I'm gonna be labeling everything and after I label all of her things, I'm gonna label my entire house. And on her school supply list, they also asked for us to buy her a two inch binder. Not sure what for. I'm thinking it's for them to like put in all of her work, like all the work that she does. So I decided to get her this like dark, salmon colored binder and they also asked us to buy copy paper so i just got her a little small pack and now we have another bag so when like little ones like this go to school they have nap time and for nap time what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to bring crib sheets because they sleep in these like cots and they put the crib sheet on the cot and then you're supposed to bring them blankets penelope doesn't have a lot of small size blankets or her blankets are like twin size and i don't want to bring this huge blanket to her class every day so i got her two little blankets that aren't so huge so the first one i got her is a paw patrol blanket and this was on clearance for ten dollars and 48 cents. You like it? Yeah. Here you go. For my bed to sleep. And then I got her a My Little Pony blanket. Another requirement for her school is that we have to bring in water bottles for her every single day. So when she's thirsty, she just gets a drink because they don't have water fountains. And they're all downstairs. I forgot to bring them up, but they're just like something similar to this. And I got this one at the dollar section. It was $3. And if you're like me, you go to Target for a couple of things and you walk out with something from every single section at Target. I had to get her clothes. Like she has so much clothes. 
She has so much clothes, but I just can't help it. I literally cannot help it. Toddler clothes is my weakness. So I got her three things. This first thing I got her is this t-shirt that says crazy little thing called love. It was like the Valentine's Day section. And then I also got this little dress. And right now it's pretty chilly in California in the morning. So I got her this long sleeve shirt. Now the next thing I'm gonna show you guys, I actually got for Penelope last year when she started Montessori school, but I never actually used it just because they provided lunch for her at her school. But this new school she's going to, they're not providing her lunch. We have to pack her lunch every single day so I am finally going to be able to put this to use so these are cookie cutters and they were from home goods the original price was six dollars but I got it half off for three and it has a shape of a heart a circle and a star and I thought Penelope would really like her sandwiches and her fruit and anything else was cut into shapes because she's such a picky eater she does not eat we stress every single day to try to get her to eat so I thought if she goes to school and she sees every kid eating she would eat and then if she sees that her food is cut into shapes she would eat it even more all right and then I just have a couple of things left to show you Guys. Penelope is fully potty trained so one thing that they wanted us to bring was diaper and wipes so I got her wipes and I didn't get her regular diapers because like I said she's potty trained but when she goes to sleep she does like to go pee pee so I bought pull up diapers for her class so when she takes her nap they can just put a diaper on her and she won't have an accident and then I just got her some wipes nothing too interesting and that is every single thing that I got Penelope and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and her little school supply haul I usually don't do like videos on my own on Penelope's channel but I knew if I let Penelope do this on her own she would have just been like wipes cup marker and the video would have been like 10 seconds long thank you for watching my video i help you like my food surprise subscribe